Sorry, I was trying to talk over myself. But yeah, I don't think I've played a game, a new game day one all year. So I'm looking forward to this. Oh. Okay. I just move the mouse. There we go. Let's check this out. Sorry, that's my chair. Sorry. I should have muted. The morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. A short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Welcome to Greater Morrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Ah well, I'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged. But I've had a few of the locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Hmm. Pursuit added. Okay. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. Greater Morrow. Okay. Undock. Oh! Move forwards with... Okay, Wazda. What? Let's tab. Okay. Peculiar engine. Install time, two hours. Oh, I see. That's... Okay. Someone's tuned this engine in an unfamiliar way. Whatever they did seems to have given it more power than normal. Custom rod. Status operational. Fishing speed plus 40%. Catches coastal. Decorated with the company colors of its creator. A strong choice for avid anglers. Cabin. Catch fish for the day. Met the mayor of, Gre of Greater Morrow, who sent me out to catch some fish and find my bearings. Seems nice enough. Warned me to be warned me to be back before nightfall. Though, said something about fog. A bit dramatic. The mayor asked me to catch as many fish as I can, then head back to Greater Morrow. Okay. 64 pages? Oh, I'm turning the page. I thought that was to... There we go. Okay. Alright. I think we can... Uh... I guess we should be on our way. Oh, rotate with that. Move to a fishing spot. Look for splashes on the surface, then press F to start fresh start feshing. <laughs> oh, disturbed water, stock high, coastal, start fishing. Oh, I see, okay. Oh, place. 
Oh, I see. Okay. We're just fishing. All right, that's depleted. Actually, let's... Actually, this might make more sense like this. Yeah, okay. So that was depleted. And now we can leave. Fish. Medium. Oh, God. Hmm. Time only advances when you're moving, fishing, or taking other specific actions. Oh, I see. Okay. So if I'm not moving, time doesn't move. I kind of like that. Starting to run out of room, though. Oh, that's a trophy fish. Practically worthless, but enough to stave off hunger. Oh, it's a blue... Oh, these are all blue, blue mackerels. That's just a trophy winning... Whoop. A trophy-sized fish? guess I should go back to the dock as cargo is full mm. you look lost fisherman are you after somewhere to sell are you after somewhere to sell your catch greater morrow is on the west side of the bay keep an eye on the lighthouse eh wouldn't want to lose sight of it for too long You enter a brightly lit shop. It's packed with antiques, the shelves full of jewelry and other baubles. An old man peers at you over silver spectacles. What is the? What game is this? It's so cute. Uh, it's Dredge. I, I guess it's like... I don't know that much about it. All I know is that it's like... Kind of a... Not really a fishing simulator, but it's just like... You go out fishing. I think it's supposed to have horror elements, but I don't remember now. I just remember seeing gameplay of it and was like, yes, I want to get this game. Uh, so I guess it's going to be a little bit of a mystery. All I know right now is that we're a fisherman and we landed at this, uh, this sort of bay. So uh, I guess we're going to discover what this game is together. Yeah, I, I, it's very, it's nice to look at. It's very, con like, yeah, I like, I like it. Hello, is that, no, 
Uh, I don't believe we've met. Forgive me. My eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Have you got anything nice with you today, perhaps? Uh, do you like fish? <laughs> uh... Ah, okay. You don't want to buy anything I have. Okay, so that's a trinket seller. Let's undock and head back to the west. To the west coast. Oh, the lighthouse is what we're looking for. I have a light, don't I? Oh. How do I use it? What? Night up the ni light up the night. Stronger lights lessen the effects of panic. Okay. That's good to know. I like the design of the town. Like it's... I do like this low poly art direction. I mean, I like low poly stuff anyway, but... I don't know, this seems a little bit more unique. You step onto the dock, to at, dock at Greater Morrow. The mayor is waiting nearby. Ah, I see you've returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off to town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you that replacement vessel, yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds to, on hand, so we'll consider it, a, consider it a loan, but I want to make this easy for you. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So, to recap, you'll need to sell fish to the local market. Oh. You'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt, and in turn, keeping the population fed and satisfied. Understand? Selling fish helps the town and pays off my debt. Got it. Off you go then. Sell those fish while they're still fresh. Yes, sir. You enter... Okay. You enter a squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around a downcast, a downcast man behind the counter. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. What happened to the other one? Heh. <laughs> he... It takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more, too. Other towns on other islands may pay you different, but while you've still got a debt outstanding here, I'd suggest you work on paying it off first. Hmm. Makes sense to me. Oh. Oh, sell all fish. There we go. Cool. How do I see how much debt I have? The mayor is standing outside the fishmonger store. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide this town provide for this town. Pursuit updated. Look here, I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you could make uh, could could make something out of it. Why don't you take it? Uh, research part? Oh, one last thing. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit.
Oh, uh, flexible fishing pole. A hybrid design allows for a more, more flexible fishing style. Okay. Hydraulic rod. Oceanic. What about cargo space? Oh, engines? Oh, improved... Improved outboard engine. Efficient propeller design makes this a reasonable engine for those on a budget. Okay. Sure. It's now available in stores. Oh. Oh, I see. As you walk into the yard, you see the shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull. She looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. Uh. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payment is up front, and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take on any damage from the rocks, or any damage at all, I can patch it up, mostly. She shrugs and gestures towards, towards the hull she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards, all well above the waterline, are splintered and scratched. Take a look around. Just remember... The bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install, so plan ahead. Okay. I don't have enough money for that. A peculiar engine. Uh. Alright, well, maybe we don't buy something new right now. Oh, well, hold on. I could do that. Oh. Okay. So now we can sh do... Alright, let's rest. Cool. Let's head out. Do some more fishing. Oh. Inspect. A floating buoy. It serves to mark safe passage past dangerous rocks and obscured hazard. Its dim light also provides a brief res uh, respite in the gloom of the night. Okay. Oh, I don't want to do that. Also, if, uh, just as a reminder, if, um, If I'm too quiet or too loud, or if the game is too quiet or too loud, let me know and I can make some adjustments. I did a quick sound check before starting the game, but uh, if anything needs a little bit more adjustment, that would be very helpful to know. Okay. Coastal. Ah, another blue mackerel. Put it there. Oh, that's depleted. Let's go here. Sound great to me? Thank you. It's good to know. Damn it. There we go. Alright, let's put you here. Ooh. 
Ooh, that was close. All right, this can go here. I could probably move some stuff around a little bit here. Like, uh, let's put that there. Put that over there. Move this here. Actually, that might give me a little bit more wiggle. Oh, crap. I forgot I had that. All right, maybe that's not going to work. All right, hold on. Let's move you over. but F there we go all right let's uh let's go back to the dock and sell oh wrong dock we need the lighthouse. Encyclopedia. What do we got? We got blue mackerel. What is this? Average price? Cod. Golf flounder. I think that's the only fish we've ever caught. Whoop, oh, uh, back. Back. Oh, I'm out of room. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, dock and sell. This is kind of neat. My storage. Oh! I don't have to sell right now. get back on the well I don't know if we should no we definitely could oh I see okay 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 uh, uh okay okay I get it now Select your lights uh, by holding E and toggle them with, oh, okay. There we go. Whoa, arrow squid. Some cool stuff there. Oh. It's okay, it's very dark. And rainy now. Cool. Exposure to fog and other things increases your panic. Oh! Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. What's my panic level at? Ah, fuck.
What's that? Where's the panic meter, though? Is it the, is it the thing at the top? Uh oh. Oh, I should uh fuck. Lighthouse. Yeah, let's uh let's go back. My hole got damaged. Goddamn rock. Whoa, what is that? Oh, now the light turns back on. Alright, I'm going to guess that my panic is getting a little high. There we go. A hunched woman approaches you from the steps of the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Why are you here? Uh, I've come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. She turns and shuffles back along the path that leads to the light. Okay. Oh, that's how much I need to pay off. Just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east towards uh, Little Morrow? Little Morrow? Uh, would you give this package to the dock worker there, please? Yeah, I guess so. The mayor hands you a small task. Uh, or hands you a small damp package bound in string. It's dripping slightly. The dock worker will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. Don't forget to check your compass and map if you get lost. Okay. Well, let me... I had a, I've had a special order come through from a customer. If you can fulfill it, I'll pay you above normal prices. Okay, tell me about the order. They asked for one gulf flounder and one great eel. Just bring them in when you have them. You'll need to have a rod that can swindle shallow water fish in order to catch those. The shipwright should be able to sort that for you. Have you got any fish for that order? I do, actually. Uh, in storage. Alright, come back when you have everything. Now, to regular business, eh? We are going to sell all fish. Debt adjusted minus seven dollars and nine cents. Ninety-one cents, excuse me. Alright. Some fish prefer deeper water while others stick to the shallows. If you're looking for something specific, it's important to know that what depth you're working with. Indeed. Alright, so we're going to the other side and we're also looking for an eel. So we want shallow water. Oh, this is coastal. That's okay. We can work with that. I think this is deeper water. Is this shallow? Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. The puzzles are each different for, um... specific fish. That's kind of... That's cool. I like that. That's neat. Whoa. Okay. Alright, well that's depleted. But we need to head over to... Um, Little Morrow. Is 
to deliver a package. And then we'll head back and deliver what needs to be delivered. Hmm, what, a delivery? Let's see here. Tears a small hole in the paper and peeks inside. You can't say for sure, but it feels as though he's shielding it from your view. Yeah, nice and fresh. This will do nicely. I'm to pay you, I suppose. He hands you some money. I was given this old book a few weeks back, but it didn't make much sense to me. Sure, you'll surely get more use out of it. Sustainable fishing added to cabin. He pulls a crumpled book from his back pocket and hands it to you. A number of the pages are folded over. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps it, you can read it while you're on the water. Stop by for a chat anytime. I know how lonely it can be. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Alright, well, I'm going to put those in storage for right now. And we'll be off. A stingray? Can't catch a lot of those. Fuck. 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 There we go. Dang. That's a new fish. Alright, what do we got here? Dredge? You don't have the right equipment for this spot. What? Shapes in the deep. Okay. Interesting. Alright, it's starting to get dark. Let's go to the fishmonger. Yes. Storage. I do have that. Sold two fish for $42.09. Fishmonger wraps up the fish and hands you some money. Good, good. They should be pleased with these. I've got another order here. This one's a little more curious. They want a couple of squid and a whole black grouper. Don't see many people fishing squid these days. They only feed at night. And well, you know what nights are like around here. Good luck. I I don't know what nights are like down here or here, but uh rot. Oh. I guess I should uh Sell all the fish that I have. I have to discard that. Okay. Mayor is walking quickly towards you. He seems to be in a good mood, with a spring in his step. Fantastic news! Thanks partly to your efforts, Greater Morrow is growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. In fact, I've granted a consent for the shipwright to expand her facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. I've also allocated some money to improve the fishmonger's services. He might have something to talk to you about soon. 
Keep up the good work. We're glad you've chosen to be here with us. Dry dock? This is the dry dock. We can make significant improvements to your vessel here. We're talking extra space, more attachment points for equipment, and even superior hulls. We need a, dis a decent stock of hard materials for the those projects. Lumber, metal scraps, that sort of thing. Uh, how do I get materials? There's plenty of decent materials around the coast, from various shipwrecks to the like, uh, and the like. I'm sure you'll find a way to get, all, uh, get at them. Materials assigned towards upgrades will be will be stored, so don't worry if you only have half of what you what we need. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, I need to. Boat's looking a bit banged up. I can repair that here if you like. Oh, yeah, sure, let's repair all. And, um... Let's, uh, do that. Plus 10 KN. Yeah, that one's fine. Perfect speed, 40%, uh, that's 10%. Strengthened lines can, uh, can catch larger and deeper fish. Okay, that's something to keep in mind. But for now, we should rest. And I'm actually going to take a short break right there. Uh oh, how do I... Uh... There we go. Okay, I'm gonna take a short break. Uh, and we will... Oh, let me put some music on first. Okay. We are going to take a short break. Uh, if this ends up on YouTube, thank you guys so much for watching. Consider watching live over at twitch.tv slash bigslicegaming. Uh, otherwise, we'll see you in the next video.